Hi, come get ready with me and chit chat about anything and everything. Put a little lime in my water. My favorite curling iron of all time is a GHG. It's beautiful. Um, did I pay an arm and a leg for it? Yes. Do I regret it? No. Okay, I'm just gonna take some wrench sections. I feel like if you're not kind of going over it a little bit first, then like, what are you doing? Because about this. I don't know how long this is going to take me, but I feel like it's going to be a minute. I was getting work done and I'm kind of obsessed with this car. It's um, a Ford Edge. So that's kind of fun. Um, Derek Jeter, he, I feel like, made the Ford Edge famous. Um, I'm not really a Ford girl, though. I'm more of like a Kia, Honda kind of girl. I, I don't know. I feel like if I get an SUV, then that just means I'm going to get pregnant. <laughs> There's no other thing about it, you know, like SUV equals have a family. I have a family, you know, like when you see a guy who wears a Hawaiian shirt, he's married. He's been married for a while. They got the silver anniversary. I don't even know what year that is, like 20, 20 or something. Oh gosh, so here we are. Um, so I'm not a good cook. Yeah. I can pretend to be a good cook, um, but the best meal I can get, the best meal you will have with me is the one that I order. Um, my biggest red flag is somebody who doesn't have good friendships okay if you can't hold a friendship down how are you gonna be with me you're not you're not gonna make it you're not gonna make it because you haven't even had that time that practice to work things out with somebody hash things out with somebody so that's a red flag All right, I don't think you need to see the whole thing. All right, could you imagine? I would not like looking like this. Yeah, no. So I always kind of go like this. George Washington, Ben Franklin style. Kind of go like that. Get a little oomph and then hairspray it. So like it's like, so you're gonna look like Ben Franklin but the end result is Farrah Fawcett. Okay, so basically I love, capital L-O-V-E, Tower 28 mascara, wonderful. Um, I'll tell you what's not wonderful is the Sephora brand mascara. It looks almost identical to this, same coloring, same font, <laughs> different vibe, different for sure. What's that thing that the kids say now? Same font, very different mascara, and I do not recommend ever 
in your life. If the girl at Sephora tries to sell it to you, say, no, thank you. I know better. I had no idea what she was talking about because she wasn't even wearing mascara. She wasn't even wearing any makeup. Girl, how can you work at a beauty store and not know anything about beauty or even wear any? Contrary to popular belief, I don't think this matters. Like an eyelash curler, I think it's, you had one, you had them all, okay? <laughs> Um, uh, it's like athletes. They're all the same. <laughs> um, anyway, so, uh, ColourPop, Hi Hyaluronic Acid Tinted Moisturizer. Um, it's pretty good. I just, you'd have to shake it because it's a little watery because there's freaking acid in it, but... I think it's wonderful. Okay, so this is probably a little too dark or too light for me. I'm a little bit, I'm a little dark right now. Summer, baby. So I'm just gonna kind of do this. And I always warm it up on the back of my hand just for kicks and giggles. I will never be one of those influencers who's like squirting things on their face and letting it slide. Um, I don't care if it looks aesthetically pleasing to people. I just think that that's weird. <laughs> I don't do things just for entertainment. I am the entertainment. <laughs> Rather go darker than lighter if you're ever doing your face makeup. And cat knocked this off the counter. So this is the Pro Concealer by LA Girl. Um, I'm just gonna go like that. Whenever people do dots on their face, like that's just, gonna be streaky and I think that that's horrible. I'm going higher, I'm doing this. This was the most solid trick that anyone has ever taught me is putting a little bit underneath your lip so they're like pouty. Girl, cause I'm not getting lip fillers. I can't afford them, I'm not ashamed to admit it. Plus I just, I don't really want to um so i just feel like i wouldn't know when to stop <laughs> okay there we go over the nose over the yellow brick road okay and if you're looking orange have no fear we can make it go away okay and then i'm gonna go right in here Oh, shoot, that looks good. I don't know why this isn't more popular. It's the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Eraser. I'm like done with this. I love it. I don't know, Tarte Shape who? <laughs> I'm kidding, I think Tarte Shape is fine. I just, I don't love it. I don't know why it's number one. It's I don't know. I I just don't. I feel like what's happening is people are like treating it like it's a Stanley and it's literally just a water cup. Like it's just a cup. You don't have to make it a big deal. This is the OG. The only thing that I like better than this is the Modern Renaissance palette. But that doesn't look good on everybody. What are you doing? What are you doing? Are you causing trouble? Are you causing trouble? <gasps> Sweet Bubby. I do lips first because I gotta go get my eyeshadow brush. Mm. I don't know why, but it smells like bubble gum.
All right, so I just got this Jason Wu Lip Butter Soft Balm Lip Balm. Um, I like it. It's just like kind of clear. Just kidding. It's got a little pigment. Just a little bit, nothing crazy. I think it's a really good topper. Or if um, you're gonna be out on the boat all day during the summer, it's good. It's good. I wiped the contour off because it's just not me. <laughs> it's like when David said, I can't wear this to battle. I can't wear this. That's how I feel. Um, okay, so I'm gonna go in with this contour palette and I'm gonna use this bronzer shade. I'm just gonna go in the crease. Dab, dab, dab. Go in with this palette, Charlotte Tilbury. I think it's just, I mean, what more could you ask for? Nothing. Nada. Okay, this like little bubblegum pink color. What's this called? I think they just give it a number. No. Enhance. Yeah, they call it enhance. Okay, that's what we're going to do. I'm just going to put it right here. Does it look like, whoa, there's your eyebrows? Or is it like normal? Let me brush these out. Okay, question, one time somebody asked me and she was like, have you ever done that? Have you ever used hairspray as a setting spray for your face? And I was like, no, I haven't. I've done a lot of things, but I haven't done that. I guess it could work, but I don't know. My face, I feel like, would just break out. Oh, look how pretty. Look how pretty. <laughs> She's stunning. <laughs> All right. What else could I possibly put on my face? Nothing. It's called smiling. All right. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you next time.